trees and hills and terrain features. But I think we can do a better job. But we've learned that when we show radar to you, I always thought that the people of Alabama would see the same thing we see. But you see it through a different filter. When we show a hook, when we show a couplet, when we show a tornado debris signature now, most of you see it as a bucket of spilled paint and there's no urgency and you typically don't do anything. And that's okay, it's human nature. We have to better communicate what that means and what you need to do and the urgency in that. And again, we know that you do react to live video of tornadoes and we're gonna be better at that. We've learned that you really don't understand the tornado warning system that well. I, and it's our fault, it's, it, let me rephrase that, it's my fault. People still think we warned by counties. We stopped doing that eight years ago. I've seen so many times where people hear there's a tornado warning for Tuscaloosa County, they immediately think they're in it and they start doing something. We don't warn by counties, we warn by geometric shapes called polygons. polygons. Yeah. See, the people that show up at these things <laughs> are good. The ones I worry about are the ones that don't show up at these things. Can you yeah. talk a little bit about the false alarm radar? 